We're back. Another video here. Breaking Bad box. Um, we're going to get right into it because I don't want to wait. You know, this is the third Breaking Bad box that I've pulled. Um, this one here, this is like right after I told you guys I was going to buy a box from Tiger. I bought a box from Tiger. He gave me a reasonably good price. He hooked me up. You know, he made a little money. And uh, Tiger, do you, do you care if I disclose the price? I got it for one ton, you know, and I'm not upset about that, you know, because uh, me and him together, we closed out the market. We raised the prices. Honestly, we should be getting thank you letters from a lot of these eBay sellers that jacked their prices on us because uh, we helped control the market here. So we're looking for the El Pollos Locos card. I would love to be able to pull that. Um, wow. Okay. So last box we pulled a salt goodman tie card and honestly i was getting pretty depressed with that last box until we uh pulled that because uh wow these are these oh wow hopefully these are, weren't resealed uh oh you know something we don't tiger no i'm just kidding <laughs> the box is sealed I these swear. are like poorly sealed but really? it's whatever yeah no 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 it's whoa it looks like a cool card right off the back missing have you seen this man walter white that's who we're looking for, people. Sticky. Of course, as all cards are. All these cards come sticky a little bit. Yes, they have their trends. Yeah, it's just because uh, they used a lot of ink on these cards, I, I would assume. But, um, wow. Looks like one of the sealers probably ran out, too. They probably had a poor sealer, too, for these. Um, let's get this. Let's get it cleaned here. Bang. All right, we're looking for the auto cards, the wardrobe cards. Breaking Bad is a very cool show, very popular show. Guy, high school teacher, cooks meth. Um, this is the th third video. I've been pulling these cards now. Um, there's very scarce. Well, it's not scarce. It's just pricey now. It's like $200 a box now. And I don't want to. Whoa. Whoa. I already know that we're going to get a, another wardrobe card here. Another piece of Saul Goodman's tie. I can almost build this man's whole tie. <laughs> Just kidding. I have two pieces now, though. That's pretty cool. Wow. I think this card's worth a lot just because of the sense that this guy's got his own spinoff show now. Like I said, I mean, you can't beat it. It's not on the market. Join it. This is great. None on the market. We'll hand it over to Tiger. He'll hook us up with a sleeve. Got the checklist card in there, too. And, um, yeah. Wow. Now we're looking for an auto card. That's the next one. Hopefully, we don't end up with the same auto of Badger. That would be uh, pretty depressing. I'd honestly cry and then probably spaz and buy another box from Tiger for like an inflated price again. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> just kidding. Whoa! Michael Brown, Uncle Jack. That's a pretty cool card, honestly. I'm not even upset about that card. Look at that autograph, too. Very s little sloppy here. P I think it's very funny how PSA grates autographs. It's like, yo, man. It's the autograph. It's what he did. How are you going to grade it? Put a grade on that can't do that pretty sick man pretty sick auto michael brown is uncle jack michael michael bowen michael bowen i'm sorry people michael bowen that's a cool card these are breaking bad is very definitely one of my favorite you know entertainment boxes to break just because of like um you know just the value just seems like it's all there Man, Walter White, what a tease. It's a shame I couldn't pull a Walter White. No Walter Whites. But uh, I guess now we're just looking for two meth cards. And honestly, let's get through it pretty quickly here, people. Because, like, why waste time? Let's go speeds. We're going for speed here. So what we're going to do is we're going to stack all of these and we're just going to speed break through them all because what are we doing but looking for money now i guess i'm looking for a heisenberg meth card or i mean something i don't have i guess you know because i already have the salt goodman card but it's cool to have two of the salt goodman because that's a profitable card in my opinion hey and, and you know it's like yeah you can't win them all you can't get everything you want in life and that's just what it is when it's a reminder that you can't pull everything you want to pull. And that's fine. 
I mean, the last video I got very fortunate, got a lot of value off a $30 box. Um, actually, a little less, but I mean, that's what I considered the value at, at least 30 bucks a box on those Playboy trading cards. But now we are on Breaking Bad. I'm not sure what show I'm going to do next. Uh, I'm going to scour the internet tonight. And we're going to look. I'm going to see what I can find. See if there is any cards with value. I'm looking for auto cards because auto cards are fun. I did make an offer on a whole entire case of Game of Thrones cards. So if I get that, you'll know. Maybe I'll pull them all in one. But here we go. Now that I've pulled them all, we'll pick them up and we'll burn through them. I keep getting these Gus cards. I don't think they're worth anything. So we're just going to throw that in the common cards pile because, like, whatever. I did get an autograph card of that guy. Whoa, that's pretty cool. These are the twins here. They're pretty cool. That's a cool card. If you see it, they're in the sunlight. The enforcers. One of my first boxes I opened of these, I did get a numbered card. I haven't seen a numbered card since, so you know that they're pretty rare, which is pretty crazy. Um... I guess I'm not getting a cup card in this. That's a shame. Because I, I would have felt the thickness as we were going through all that. I would have got crazy for a second. You know, nothing crazy here again. I'd be disappointed if I don't get any meth cards, honestly. The meth cards are pretty cool. You're paying for an autograph, a wardrobe, and a, a wardrobe. <laughs> See here I said that? Whoa! This is a cool card for sure. I saw a guy pull this online. He said he was going to get it graded. I might do the same. Just follow him up. Wow. Let's raise the value together, brother. Awesome. It's a cool card. Cool card. Gus, everybody. Gus. Gus Hollow. Um, yeah, but, you know. But like I said, you're looking for the, um, the autograph, the wardrobe, and at least two meth cards. It's cool that you get a couple of those foil cards, but I mean, the meth cards are like, I think they're automatic money because it's just different type of card. Whoa, Hank Schrader, meth card. Got one of those already, but that's okay. Because he was a very popular character. And that's okay with me. Having double ups, I mean, now I can sell one, keep one, you know, watch the value rise. These are a little stuck together, oh, nothing. I, am, I do see a little bit of a meth card towards the bottom there. That's kind of cool. So we'll see what we can pull there. All right. So we're getting down to it, people. I'd like to pull a numbered card one day. Whoa. And Marie Schrader again. That's cool. It's not It's not that bad. I mean, like, you know, we pulled, like I said, we get the uh, Hank and Marie again. The combo. I bet that I could really pull 50 for this. No problem, I think, with the couple. And uh, aiming for the sky, maybe a hundred, but we'll see what happens. Well, that's that'll do it for our third Breaking Bad box. Um, maybe we'll get another one one day. We'll see. Uh, let's run back through what we pulled. Uh, we got this uh, Michael Bowen, Uncle Jack auto card. We all know how it ends for him. It's personally signed by him. Then we got the two meth cards. Very fun. A couple of villains here, Gus and uh, the twins. And to wrap it all up, we got our boy here, Saul Goodman. You know, we didn't pull uh, the Walter White card, but Saul Good, man. The corners so, are better on that one, too. Really? Wow, the corners are better on this one. So the other one will be for sale. We'll see what happens. Thank you for watching and uh, like and subscribe. We'll uh, get on to the next video.